What would make regular stuff way cooler? A pop of color, of course! And with the right paint on hand, you can create some serious masterpieces! Who knows? You may create the next Mona Lisa! Or at least a really cool-looking laptop case! Ready to put on your artist hat? Mmm, so good! Anyway, I spy some eyes! Cover them up! Yep, this next challenge ought to be fun! Okay, hey! This is the challenge, see? Yes! This is the best one yet! We love us some poppins! Now I know it'll be the right size! And I've got my colors ready! One purple coming right up! Purple row, done! What the… There! It's ready! Careful… I know! Time to get serious! Brian? What's that thing for? You'll see soon enough! Ooh! That's right! I have cool! And this is how it's done! Paint little dots along the rod. Make more in another row. And in a whole new color. Do all the colors of the rainbow. Almost finished here. And this is where the magic happens. Before it has time to dry, roll it on out. Gina, check this out! This is how you do it. Nicely done. But Brian, now that's what I call a masterpiece! Just call me the Poppet King. Thank you. Thank you very much. Huh? What's going on? How come she has a snack? Excuse me, can I have some of the snack? No, no. We're here for a challenge. Let's see what the spinner chooses for the first challenge. A minion? Really? Yes! Well, good. Huh? Here are some bananas and toilet paper for you. What are we supposed to do with these? Hey, take a look! Look how ridiculous she looks! Oh my gosh, you're so right! But I still don't know what I'm supposed to do with this teepee. I really don't get it. Hey, wait a second! I know exactly what I should do! I'll use this rope, too! Alright, got my cup of water. And I've got my colors, too. Okay, here's my paintbrush and banana! Time to get to work on this challenge! I'm gonna actually start with a pen, so I can draw on the banana. And now I'm gonna start painting. I'll begin with white. There we go! Now let me move on to the black. The black is for the pupil of the eye, of course. And now I get to move on to the blue, which the minions are known for! Hmm, alright, I see where that's going. Teeth time! He's got a cute and funny smile! I'll paint a little red here for his tongue. Onto the dark blue overalls! This is actually a lot of fun! Yes! There we go! My minions are ready to go! Whoa! Hey, look at me! I'm a minion! Whoa! That's actually impressive! You really look like one! What ingenuity! I'm pleased! Here are my completed minions. What do you think? Well, I think you're the winner! Those are very nice minions! Congrats! You did such a good job! You deserve it! Thanks! All right, we're totally ready to tackle a drawing challenge! I'll spin the wheel and see what you'll be facing. There we go. Oh, how sweet! A heart. Time to draw love! Yay! I love drawing hearts and love stuff! I know what I'm gonna do. I'll start with the word love. Hmm. Wow, that was a great day. She was so beautiful in that meadow. Okay, now to really zazz this picture up. I'll add a little heart and then turn the O into a girl. The V can be another heart, and the E can be the person she likes. So cute! But it needs more color. This heart should be pink. Good. And the little one up here should match too. Okay, now for some more colors. A purple dress. Wow! This is really turning into something special! Time to switch colors! Yellow for their hair! They match! And I think he's wearing a blue hat. Time for some green on his shirt! No, I love you the most. These colored pencils will help give them expressions. Ta-da! Oh, 
All right, students, let's see your artwork, please. Uh huh. What? Oh no. Ew. Keep the gum in your mouth, please. Um, what are you doing? Uh, just wait. This is my artwork. I promise. I just need one more moment. Almost done. I'm done. There. Here's my artwork showing love. Phew. Whoa! How did you even do that? Amazing! Oh my goodness! That is very impressive! Hi, Marks! I'm pretty excited to be here. I wonder what we'll have to do. Mmm, I didn't know the tea in this place would be so delicious. Look at that over there! Oh wow, look at how beautiful they all are. So much color. I've never seen anything like it before. Indeed. Look at how they move in the wind. So beautiful. I absolutely love them and their beauty. Hmm, this tea has gone off, I think. Hmm, gonna be sick. Oh man, come on! We are being so complimentary of them. Oh my goodness, isn't that unfortunate? Why are you laughing at me? You got pooped on too. Huh? What are you talking about? Oh my. Uh, see, I drank out of this cup. Oh my goodness, <laughs> this is actually quite funny. Why are you laughing? There were two poops! Wait a second. <laughs> that gives me a good idea. Oh, ugh, this white canvas will not work. There we go. This is much better, I think. Okay, I need some chalk. And then I'll draw the number two. Since that was my inspiration. And then I'll need to draw a second two. <laughs> two twos. Then I'll build up from there. Have to make some waves around here. And a straight stick. Gotta put some feathers over here. This will be the wing. Can't forget to draw a cute little eye. And of course, it can't be a bird without a beak. Time for a fun little chalk trick. Blending. Ew, this is so gross. Why did this happen to me? And I'm done with my picture. Ahem, take a look at my artwork. I believe I did an excellent job capturing the parents. Oh my goodness, I love it. Huh? No! You've got to be kidding me! Uh, where did she go? Oh well, I guess we can relax. Mmm, my favorite soda. Nice. I'm looking forward to this. Mmm, that tastes good. Hey, what are you doing? Pick a number. Uh, I'm sorry. Come on, we don't have all day. Let's go for number three. Excellent choice. Oh, a snowflake! Wait, this is timed? We better get started. This should be fun. I'll start with a basic shape. Then fill in the details. Okay, now for the next one. I'll do the same basic shape, but draw some zigzags in the center. That looks good. Okay, what's next? I'll do a little more detail in this one. They say no snowflake is identical. I'm really happy with these drawings. I wonder how Justin is doing. Shh, I'm trying to concentrate. Time is running out. Hold on, there! Oops, it was an accident. I'm sorry. It's going everywhere! No! My drawing's ruined! I'm so sorry. You need to be careful. Hey, look at that. Something's happening. I'll just blow this off. Whoa! What? What's going on? Justin? Where are you? Oops. <sighs> it's so cold. Tell me about it, buddy. Where am I? Beats me. I've been stuck here for years. I'm gonna catch a cold. Can I borrow that? Wait a minute. Bigfoot! Oh! A human! <laughs> You'll never believe what just happened. Oh, I'm never going outside again. Thanks. So cold. Oh well, that'll teach you. I can't feel my face. One, two, three! And… We got the blue shell! Oh, Kitties are my favorites! Alakazam! Oh! Come on! There! How does she do that? I wonder what's inside here? A gold coin? 
You try. Don't need to pull my arm. Hmm. I think I feel something. <gasps> it's a real kitty! Aw, he sure is cute, huh? What do you think his name is? I say we call him Marshmallow. Mmm, I guess. How did I get stuck with this? I know! I'll use it to draw my own cat! All I need is the perfect cat circle. Then everything else falls into place! He's really coming together, see? It's amazing what just a few different shapes can do! And a pop of color, of course. Just a couple more accents. And done! So cute! Thanks for this! Whoa! Who's my baby? Marshmallow? You didn't draw anything. I was distracted. Show me your kitty creations! Well, this is embarrassing. It's my best work yet! Meow! <gasps> it's possum! Thank you! Didn't feel inspired, Brian? Alakazam! Huh? Marshmallow? What's up next, mom? Sounds good, right? I guess that can't be hard, right? Brown is just the right color. It's on! Everyone knows how to draw a cupcake, right? These look like something different. We both did the poop emoji, see? It's awfully cute, isn't it? They're looking good! Just gotta make those baby blues. I need to fill in the body. They're really coming together. But girls, that's not quite a cupcake. Art is all about interpretation. Let's flip these bad boys! Boom! We did it! And they're both fantastic! And? Um, I don't know. I guess you both, well, lose. No winner? Hey, come here! Yeah! Let's get out of here! All right, ladies, we've got your party food. That, uh, doesn't look like food. Suit yourselves. Hey, sir, care for a snack? Geez, fine. <laughs> Hi, friends! Let's get our grub on! No? You know, on second thought, <laughs> at least we got her to one! Wanna split this guy? Done and done! Mmm! Not bad at all! Especially for something shaped like this. Not much to do down here, huh? Yeah, but I kinda like the break. I'm enjoying my snack. Oh my gosh! What is that? The principal! She's here! All right. Pay attention. I'm looking for this puppet phone case, okay? All right. Look, I even have a phone template for you. Phone templates? Man, this doesn't sound very fun. But I'm definitely gonna beat you. We'll see. Hmm. Already have a great idea. Yep. Candies are the solution. As always. I'll start putting them in place on the template. Gotta make sure they're nice and lined up, too. Okay, and then I'll just fill the whole shape of the phone. Now that's what I'm talking about. Well, two can play the being clever game. I've got this mini rolling pin and it's gonna help me win. <laughs> that rhymed. Okay, but now I need my paints. I'll just add some orange polka dots on my rolling pin. All the way across in a line. And then onto the next colors. 
Ooh, this blue is so bright! I absolutely love it! Blue might be my favorite color! Okay, dots are made and now I'm ready to roll! Ha! Look at that! It totally worked amazingly well! Hey! Miss Principal! I'm done with my art! Huh? Oh, right. The artwork. Let me see. Hmm, okay, okay. I see what you did there. Very nice. Now, how about you? Oh, of course. I think you'll be greatly impressed by my work. Oh, shoot! I'm so dumb! I can't believe I just did that! I really had something, I promise! Okay, alright, I believe you. But you're not the winner. She is! I get the phone as a prize? Amazing! Thank you so much! And now I can play with the pocket case, too! Ooh, I can call in an order, too! Yes, one large, please. Thanks! Oh, that was fast! Excellent service! Yes! It's pizza time! I'm starving and this looks so good! Oh wait, he's still feeling pretty bummed. Hey, I ordered a pizza. Would you like to share it with me? Oh sure, I would. Thank you very much! Time for the next challenge! Please pick a number. Play for it! I win! Number one. Let's see what's behind number one. What a pretty dress! Oh, I like that. I can do this. I'll need all these pencils, though. This is such a good idea! I should design dresses for a living! Uh, you might want to calm down. Oh. Right. Good luck with that. Hmm. I'm not sure this'll do. It's the latest fashion trend. Yeah, right. I guess I'm losing this round. Oh! The table! What a mess. Do you think I'm in trouble? I better clean it off. It's not coming off! Scrub harder. Oh. Wait a minute! It's gone! As good as new. Give me that. I have an idea. I'll place a template over the drawing. Now I'll dab paint on it. I'll use different colors as I work my way down. It's like a rainbow. This is gonna look great! Almost finished! Now I'll remove the template. I'm pretty happy with that. I need a manicure. Oh, wait. Are you finished? I think you'll be impressed. I… I've lost my drawing. Jasmine wins this round. Obviously. Nice job. I'd wear it. What do you think we'll get next? All right, you two. Are you ready? It looks like your selection this time is boy. I'm interested to see what you come up with. Hmm. I'm kind of bummed about this one. Not gonna lie. Huh? Oh no! I'm out of snacks! Now that's something to be bummed about. Well, now what am I gonna do? Hang on a second. I've got this empty plate now. Yep, this is totally gonna work. I've got a great plan. What are you even doing over there with that plate and marker? I don't get it. Why are you drawing on the plate like that? Don't worry about me. I know what I'm doing. Gonna just finish up my little stick man on this plate. Hmm, boy. What should I draw for that? I'll try with my words again. That seems to work well for me. Okay, there we go. Boy, now it's time to transform it. Give him some glasses and now some hair. Looking good. Can't forget your ear, though. Or his chin, nose, and mouth. All right, I've got my stick man. I think he needs a balloon, too. There. And he needs a string so the balloon doesn't fly away. Ugh. There's something in my teeth. It's obnoxious. No good. Maybe something to drink will help. Hmm. Maybe a little better, I think. I think you need some orange hair. Just a little bit more and your hair will be good to go. All right. You want a green shirt? Sure thing. I'm done! <gasps> no! You spilled water all over my guy! He's drowning! I have to do something to save him! No, no, no! Stickman, don't panic! Wait. Something's happening! Something's going on with my stickman! You're right! He can't drown because it floats! He's so cool! I love him! You did a great job! I win this one? No way! That's amazing! I'm Cheryl! I'm making pancakes! Oh look, I'm Essie! I'm so special! I have a 3D pen! Flipping pancakes is so hard! Whoa, you two are mean. Ahem. Just kidding! 
Let's spread some love with this emoji. Do we have to? Let's get it over with. Fine. Uh, where's my pen? It was right here. Huh? Don't mind me. What are you doing? My hair! Sorry, can I just have a look in here? What? Get out of here. It's so nice to- Essie? <laughs> that was weird. What is she doing? Who cares? I've got pancakes to make. I'll start with the mouth. Then the eyes and outline. I'll fill in the hearts. And then use yellow for the face. This one is easy. Almost there. Okay, I'll leave it to cook. What's your problem? You know, never mind. I think it's ready. Wow, look at it go! Uh, where is it? What? This color really suits me. Uh, I can't explain. Hand it over! I'm watching you. Let's get to work. I'll start by drawing some lines. And make them bigger as I go. I want this to be amazing. A perfect circle. Let's draw the eyebrows. I'll just make a small squiggle with a 3D pen. And now the eyes. This is actually quite relaxing. I'm enjoying it. I'll give it a nice big smile. It's just like an emoji. I can't forget the love hearts. I'm so impressed by this. <laughs> oh! Woohoo! Gravity works! Okay, that's pretty good. They're both excellent. It's a tie. Whoa! Nice! You can't leave me, Mom! <laughs> I'll only be gone an hour, sweetie. Now get up off the floor. Oh. I'll see you soon, okay? Play with your sister. Do I have to? Ugh, look at that face. Don't worry, we can play. Let's race the cars! Yeah! Well, I guess I can play that. I want the white one. Get on the floor, okay? <sighs> I wonder how long she'll be gone. As exciting as this is, why do boys love cars so much? Hey! I know how to make this more fun! I can just draw on the table! Are you insane? Very bad. Good thing I've got all these. Aw, oh, man. I think I got it all. What can we do now? Everyone likes soccer, right? Come on, it'll be fun. Hey, watch this. Catch! I missed. But it is fun, I guess. Hey, check out this trick. Cool, right? No! Gabby! What? You can't draw on all the furniture. I told you. Uh, sorry. But I know something I can draw on. Oh, I've got all this wall space. It's gonna be my big masterpiece. Here I go! My arm is so tired. Gabby? Where are you? <gasps> no! Oh gosh. I'm back, kids. What the? You're home! Look what I made just for you! <gasps> You're never watching her again! Oh, ever! Gosh. Ever! Hold up. I'm taking control here. Put the crayon down! Ooh, Gabby, don't do it! Put it what? I can't take this stress anymore! <laughs> that was my favorite crayon! Wait, I'm sorry. Don't cry. Wanna have some fun with crayons? Simply use a blade to shave them down. And use a bunch of colors. Then press and spread. You can even draw on it. I call this Mr. Rainbow. Don't forget the legs. There. 
Isn't he cool? I love it! Can I try? Kids, I'm home! You have fun without me? Uh, again! Oh, I love seeing them play together. You guys ready for this one? Pink means… An eagle! Not done yet! What? Is this supposed to mean something? Is it a secret code? Let me see something here. Hmm. This is a real thinker. I wonder what I should eat for lunch. Ooh, she sure knows what she's doing. <gasps> My hand hurts! That's it! The dots just anchor the eagle! Now I just have to color it in! It's better if I speed it up. Looking good! And that's all, folks! Done? Ooh, just in time! Check it out! <gasps> I'm very impressed! Aw, shucks. Uh, I did mine freestyle! Plus, it's sparkly! Do you love it? It's like a mermaid bird! <laughs> okay. <laughs> I wonder what we'll have this time. Pick a number. Three! One! Three! One! No, we're not picking one! Let's compromise. Two! Okay. It's only fair. Number two, reveal yourself. Wow, a cute fluffy sheep. Your time starts now. Aww! I don't have time for this! <gasps> I better get started! Did you just steal all the pens? What is that? Ew! You're just jealous! Sure, that's it. <laughs> that's pretty accurate! Watch and learn. Do you like magic? Isn't that for little kids? Prepare to be amazed. Is that my money? Is that all you have? It's a little small. I know. How did that get back there? I'm not complaining. That's just what I need. I'll place the coin on the paper. Then I'll draw little M shapes around it. Okay, now I'll remove the coin. Time to draw the face. This isn't bad. I just need to add some finishing touches. And I'm done! That's it! Time's up! Let me see your work. Ta-da! Admit it, it's pretty adorable. It's okay. Hey! Where are you going? Get back here! Ha ha ha! I win, right? Yes, Justin. You win. Woohoo! Well done. The garden is just lovely today. Oh, an apple right from the source! Look at all of these lovely fruits just waiting to be gathered! Hey, do you see what I see? She's so cute! It smells so delicious and sweet! Oh my goodness! I can't believe it! Look at this beautiful arrangement! My goodness, these blooms frame a mirror! Oh wow, look at that! She really loves those flowers! I can't believe it! I'll have to take another look! This can't be me! Can it? Have I grown younger? <sighs> I was so beautiful back then! Is it a magic mirror, do you think? I don't know! Oh! I just feel completely inspired now! Where is she going? Eh, doesn't matter. I better check my mirror. Hmm, where do I want to start? Oh, are you gonna paint me? Okay, hold on one second. I can do something better, I promise! Oh, yes! That's what I want to do! A stroke here, and over here too! Yes! Yes, paint me like one of your French girls, or something. What a wonderful day I'm having! <laughs> yes, you're being the perfect muse, Grandma! Maybe if I try to plump up my skin a bit. <gasps> oh! What is it? What do you want? You're done? Okay! Here you go, Grandma! This is the portrait I did of you! What? Did you 
not see my reflection in the mirror. Wait a second. You, go away. I need the space. Shoot. Okay, Grandma, stay right there. Hmm, I need to take some measurements here. What? What are you doing? Got it. Now I just need to place my fists on the canvas. Now I just need to trace my knuckles here. Great. Now I just need to add on to the shape. This little swirl can trail down like this. I'll continue the pattern over here, too. I'll add the little bow, too. More little hair swirls down here. Time for the eyes. Two of them, of course. All right, next will be the eyebrows. And I'll start on the nose. I'll add some hearts, too. And now it's time for some color. I'll start with yellow. She's gonna be a pretty blonde, just like that mirror reflection. And I think I'll give her blue eyes to go with that blonde hair. The bow can be red. That'll be pretty. I think her lips can match the bow, too. I'll give her some rosy, youthful cheeks. Can't forget about filling in the hearts. Uh-huh. Done. Hey, Grandma, I'm done with your portrait. Okay, listen to me. Take this portrait over to the grandma and show her. This is what she thinks she looks like. Exchange it for the mirror. All right, so take it over there. Go on, head over. Hello, Grandma. Here's another portrait of you. Oh my goodness, thank you so much. Well, you can have it if I can have your mirror. Give up my mirror? Oh, I don't know about that. Oh, I don't know if it's working. I need that mirror. <sighs> okay, fine. I will make that exchange. Hey, I got the mirror just like you asked. Yes, thank you so much. <gasps> ah, what the heck? Is this what I look like? Do I really have such a picky looking nose? <laughs> ah! Hmm, let me see how I can frame this well. Oh gosh, I got lipstick all over my teeth. Hmm, maybe I need to try this angle instead. Okay, yep. Now I can finish up this drawing. Ta-da! There, I finished the drawing of the principal. This is how you draw a portrait. You see? Now I challenge you to color this in. Well, if that's the case, then we're gonna need makeup. Here's one for you to use, too. All right, my makeup is all set out and ready for me to use. I wonder where I should start with my makeup. Oh yes, this. I'm a big fan of a bold lip color. It's really in right now. This pink is so pretty. I really love it. Now onto blue. Here we go. Onto the eyelids we go. This blue has a lot of nice sparkles in it. Can't forget some blush. I want to really highlight these amazing cheekbones. I need some color highlights for this hair, too. Oh, this purple's excellent. I kind of wish I had purple hair. And I added some freckles to her, too, because they're cute. Ta-da! I'm done coloring my portrait! I finished mine as well. Ma'am, we're ready to be judged. Yeesh, that is some makeup you did there. I don't want to look at it. Oh, I love how yours turned out. So pretty. Ta-da! You win another prize. This palette. Yes! I love getting new makeup. I can't wait to try it. Huh? Hey, wait a second. This isn't makeup. It's white chocolate. Mm. What? But, but, what about my picture? I think she's pretty enough to kiss. Well, I love her, even if no one else does. What? Ah! I've turned into a clown! We're ready for our next challenge! Oh, I love dance! Looks like you've got a ballerina! Wait, what? How are we supposed to work with that? Don't look at me, I've never even seen a ballet! Wait, I know! I'll need this paper. I can fold it in half like this. What are you doing over there, origami? That can be pretty neat. I know, but you have to make sure to fold the paper just right. I started with a center fold like this. Then again the other way. Open it up, fold down both the corners. Good. Then the bottom flap needs to come up on both sides. Yeah, this is going great so far. I love folding paper. These popped up corners need to go back down. Corners over here, too. Just a little more. Getting closer. These sides both have to fold up. There! I did it! I made a little boat out of my piece of paper. What do you think? Do you like it? There! Perfect! A pair of little paper sails for my boat. But how is it for dance? Oh, because a boat dances along the waves as it sails. Wait, what? That's seriously what you're going with? That's totally not gonna work! She's right, see? The picture is on a ballerina, not a boat. Uh, okay, fine. But I think I can still do something with origami. Are… are you just making another boat? Because again, won't work. No, it's not another boat. Look, I made a unicorn this time. Woo! You've got a unicorn! You're amazing! <laughs> Still isn't gonna count. Okay, you're right, but I've got this. Third time's the charm. I'll use two colors of paper this time. That'll help for sure. Hmm, what are you doing? Wow, this is hard. How are you doing that? You're going so fast, it's hard to keep up. 
Yes, I'm done! I made a beautiful rose! For you! It's so lovely! I can't believe you made this for me! But what the heck am I gonna do? <gasps> I know! I just need to start over with my folds! I'm gonna use the edge of this ruler to help keep my folds crisp. This part is a bit tricky. Gotta pop it out like this. And on the other side, too. Okay, I need to add some artwork. Just gotta draw a cute little ballerina on my paper. She's so cute! Okay, but I need to draw other parts, too. Gotta make sure she still has her face and hands here. And then do the same on the other side, too. Once I'm done up there, I need to do the same thing with her leg flaps. I think I'll give her some color so she's prettier. But I can't forget to color it on each of the flaps. And I think I'll finish her outfit with a blue tutu. That's cute! Blue over here and blue over there. Yes! I'm finished with mine! Ta-da! Here, let me show you how it works. If I take the flaps and fold them up and down, I can make her dance! <laughs> Look at her go! So beautiful! Whoa! Wow! What a spectacular job! You win! Yes! I knew I would! But… Whoa. What was that? Uh… <laughs> that was so funny! I'm glad you're having fun! No one noticed. It's cool. I want you to draw a banana. Got it! This'll be no problem. Bananas are easy. Now I'll flip it over. Uh, that's not right. What's wrong with this? Shouldn't there be a plug here? Sabotage! Oops. Excuse me, I need to draw a banana. This'll be straightforward. But I'm gonna be a little artistic. Wow, this is looking great! Time for some yellow! I'll just fill in the sections. I'll definitely win this round. It's looking pretty realistic. I'll use a darker yellow for the skin. I'll take my time. I wanna get it just right. I don't wanna slip up. Ha! Finished! Come on, you know this looks good. I'm not talking to you. Something wrong? No funny business this time, okay? Okay, focus. I really need to be Essie. That's the outline done. I'll do the banana now. Maybe I should do this professionally. Cheryl's House of Pancakes. It's pretty catchy. Wait, I need to concentrate. Almost done! Wow, I like this one! Essie? Come on, let's go! Uh, hey! Ta-da! This is rough. It's a tie. I'll take that! Well done! <laughs> Whoa. She suspects nothing! Your next challenge is to draw a unicorn. Yes! I love unicorns! That's like a horse, right? I'm awful at drawing animals. Psst. What? Check this out. So much cash. It's yours if you draw my unicorn. Sarah. No, draw it yourself. It's your loss. I'm gonna fail this round. That seems a little dramatic. I know a good hack for this. I'll place my hand on the paper and draw around it. Now I'll fill it in. It's such an easy way to draw a unicorn. I'll color it in now. Pink is the perfect color for a unicorn. Aw, it's so cute! I'll add more color to the horn. That was so quick! It's all done! Aw, look at it! Why are you so happy? Hmm, this gives me an idea. I can just copy Molly. But I'll make mine a rich unicorn! This makes the perfect horn! Good art costs money. What do you think? Seriously? It's the exact same as mine! Uh, no. Mine costs more. Yoo-hoo, teacher! Oh, look at that. Wonderful. Well done, both of you! I'm an artist! Fine. I'll let you have this one. Oops. I have a good rose. And for your very first challenge… We're drawing a goose. Think you can do better? Hey! Wow! 
I can do that! So cute! Now, where do I begin here? Yes! It's all about the angle of the pen. What you drawing over there? I want to see your technique, okay? Stop covering it! <sighs> what can I use here? This hand is suddenly very inspiring! And I know just what to use it for! First, trace all around your fingers. The thumb is the head. And the hand is its body. Can't forget the cute little feet. See how color makes all the difference? This goose is a happy yellow. Brown works well for the feet. Almost there! Phew! Okay, let's see him. It's a goose, see? My turn? Well, what do you think? They're both pretty spectacular. This goose sure is making a splash. <laughs> Feels good! What do you think we'll be doing next? This paint roller won't work. Get out of here. What's she going on about now? I hope you're ready to create artwork again. Oh gosh. Time for the spinner. Let's see what it's gonna choose. Dance. What a great choice. Dance? Really? How are we gonna make this work? Maybe I just need to get a good perspective. What if I look at it from this angle, maybe? Maybe I should just start by drawing. Ooh, I'm really loving how my ballerina's turning out. Oh shoot. My pencil light snapped. Now what am I gonna do? Oh, there's a pencil sharpener. That'll do. Let me get my pencil sharpened again so I can get back to my drawing. Better sharpen all the pencils, actually. Might need other colors. And I don't want to be caught out with a dull pencil. Phew. Wait a second. Wow! I've got an even better way to finish my drawing now. Look at how pretty this looks around her waist. I think this'll be lovely. This is the last one. And it can go right here. Okay. Now I need to use a black marker to make it darker. There. Let's have this crayon add some skin color. A highlighter will give her some pretty yellow hair. And then a pink crown and a pink leotard. Oh, And ballet slippers, too! I almost forgot about those. I'm done! And I absolutely love her! Oh my! Wow! But what about this angle over here, maybe? Ah! Oh! Oh my! Are you okay? Are you injured? Ow! My ankle! I think I twisted it! <laughs> Quick! Elevate it! Huh? Who's that guy? Check out his outfit! Where on earth did he come from? We should say hi! Hey, uh, pound it! Ooh, bare arms? Oh, no ink, no friendship! I'm telling the teacher on you! No ink? So ridiculous! Mister? Can't you see I'm working here? Ugh! First step done! Now what's next? Mommy! Nobody at school likes me! What? How much do tattoos cost? <laughs> nope. Don't even think about it. But maybe something less permanent. <laughs> you like stars, don't you? This is way less painful than a needle. Dip it in water and make a bunch of shapes. Time to go in for another dip. We can make a ton of them! See them all floating around? Oh, hold on. Hello? What you doing? Whoa! Ooh, refreshing! Is that me? Do my arms next! Do a spider! No, mom, I don't want to go back. Aw, oh, man. I can't believe this. Oh, hey, you guys, look it! Uh, I have ink too, see? What? Hey! The kid's one of us! Look! Whoa! Those are sick, dude! Where'd you get them? My mommy! Hey! That's the coolest mom ever! Excuse me? Come back here! Good. Bye! It's a heart this time! You'll need some more supplies! Go for it, girls! 
Look at all these pens! Wow! That's all I've got! Seriously? <laughs> Good luck! Oh! I have an idea! This will look amazing! I'll draw a giant heart! So far, so good! Now I'll draw a smaller heart inside! It's perfect! That's awful! Hey! Look at my drawing! That's nice. I suppose I better draw something. Hang on. I have an idea! I'll use the pen and the pencil at the same time. Now for the fun part. I'll draw lines across the center of the heart. That should do it. Now I'll add shading. I'll add thicker shading at parts to create shadows. This is going to plan! Now I'll cut it out around the top of the heart. Miss, miss! I finished! <laughs> Sorry. Okay, let's see your art. Ooh, very clever, Molly. I like it. Uh, Sarah? Where is your heart? It's over there! Oh! It's… it's like street art. Different approaches, but both excellent. I love them. Aw, thanks! The first challenge is the human food you call pizza. I love pizza. This should be easy. This is making me hungry. I wish I had a yummy slice of pizza right now. Hmm, I know. Let's create some pancake art. Let's start with a triangle. Then I'll fill in the crust. Pancake batter is so much better than paint. Hmm. I want pepperoni. I'll make some dots with this pink batter. Gotta have lots of toppings. There. And now for the cheese. I'll just go around the pepperoni. I don't want to ruin it now. Once it's cooked, I'll flip it. Steady. And I'm done! Pretty good, huh? Essie? This is amazing! What? You have pizza? What's wrong? Do you want a slice? But… how? Ugh, it smells terrible! It belongs in the trash. My pancake pizza is good though, right? Sure, Cheryl. I better get started. This 3D pen will make great art. I'll start with the outline. A triangle is easy to draw. This is perfect for the base. I'll fill in the triangle, and now I'll draw the crust. I just need to stay in the lines. My base is finished! Every pizza needs cheese. Wow, it looks just like melted cheese. Mmm, a cheese pizza. But it needs some toppings. I'll do pepperoni, too. It's my favorite! Pretty mouth-watering, huh? I'm tempted to take a bite. No way! Why have a slice when you can have a whole pizza? Jealous. Cheryl wins. Yes! I knew it! I'm the greatest! Another drawing coming at ya! You ready for this? Yellow means… Square. Good luck! I think I can do something. I did this in preschool. Whoa! Someone paid attention in geometry. I'm not down with that. That's more like it. Hmm. This is gonna be good. Let's see them. A square! Is that even a shape? It's… something… Square! Thanks, Captain Obvious! Now do you see it? Whoa! Did you see that sorcery? <gasps> it's genius! Uh, mine's just not folded yet. There. See it better now? <sighs> a for effort, Brian. Aww. Stupid square. Show me? It's really easy. Just follow this. Now connect the lines you've made. Starting to look like a shape now! Wow! Huh. I don't 
think I want to be a painting. Oh, better check the time. Almost done. Hey, stop! Time is up! Let me see your artwork! No, 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 I'm not done yet! I need more time! All right, let me see what you got. Don't disappoint me. Ah, this is horrible! You're missing the color black! Oh no! The paint on the picture was still wet! What did you do to my laptop? Oh, well, I guess it's actually my fault for startling you. Why did you do this to me? The worst! Oh, miss, there's a cloud. <sighs> okay, I think I can fix this. I'll be right back. Okay, I think what will solve this paint problem is more paint. I'll use this pink. I'll just layer the colors. A whole range of colors. Time to introduce straw power. Well, and blowing power, really. Ooh, the colors are spreading. It's looking really cool. Okay, there. I've covered the whole space. It looks great. <coughs> Miss? What's that now? Here. See? I fixed the paint problem on your computer. Hmm, let me see. Good use of color. Nice placement. Come down here. Hmm, what do you think is going on here? Oh my gosh, what's happening? Oh no! Whoa, how did we get here? Miss, we're in a challenge! I really gotta work on my brush technique. Harder strokes, come on! <sighs> anyway... Okay... Isn't this evening just beautiful? Hey look, real artists! Hi! Isn't that the cutest couple ever? Uh, if you like that mushy stuff… I love you so much, honey. I feel inspired. I want to transfer this love onto the page. Uh-huh. There. Could these subjects be more boring? I prefer to follow my own heart. One glob of paint at a time. This way, the colors get mixed for me. And you can have fun with the lines. Here comes the color! There! Almost finished with the dots. Now crumble up some aluminum foil and use it to blot the wet paint. This gives it some nice texture. See what I mean? Then go in with the brush and do a little polishing up. What's an outdoor scene without a good tree? Just try not to be too heavy-handed. More blotting. There! Doesn't this look awesome? But we've still got more to do. This color mixing makes it look less rigid. But it could still use a little refinement. See? There are lovers in here. They're just not the main focus. Nice! Now for some rain. Because that's ever so romantic. Ta-da! Is this romantic enough? Mine sure is! How about yours? Eh. Could be better. Do you like it? Wow! That deserves to go in a museum! Really? Guess that makes me the winner! Good job, Jen! Come here! Please? I guess you can have it. It's us, sweetie pie! Ciao! Time for the spinner again. Huh. Alright, there it goes. It's spinning once more. Looks like it chose a starry sky. I know! Where's the paint? I need to get started! The paint is ready and so is my brush. Time for art! Okay, I'm gonna start with this black color. I wanna paint a streak. Now for a glob of blue right below. And then more globs of purple, blue, white, yellow, and orange. Now I'm just gonna get to brushing the paint from side to side. It's creating a sort of ombre effect. Okay, let me keep going here with the yellow. Great, that looks good. And then I'll do more black down here. I think maybe I want some structures in my skyline too. A little fence is nice, right by this tree. I don't want bare branches, though. Some dabs will create leaves. Oh, very nice. I guess maybe I should just start and see what happens. Blue it is! And maybe some more blue, too! Yeah! I like all these dark colors. They're fun! Alright, paintbrush. You ready to get to work? Whoa! I really love how these brush strokes are turning out! Ooh, look at that paint getting pushed across the canvas! There we go! All the way down to the edge. 
Ah! Paint is getting all over my canvas! <gasps> Wait a second! This looks amazing! Hey, look at my canvas! I'm done with my starry sky! Yes, I can see that. Yours is absolutely delightful! Yes, thank you so much! You definitely deserve it! Hmm. Is that what you're working on over here? I'm not sure. I think it might need something else right over here. Oh, what are you doing? That's my art! I don't want fish! Nonsense. This piece definitely needs these fish. There! You deserve that! Oh yeah? Well, take this then! Oh, that's it! Have some pink! Fine! Here's some green for you, you Grinch! You are the worst! Ugh! You'll have to get through my roller first! Ha-ha! Oh my gosh! What the heck is going on over here? Oh! That is it! You both need a challenge after this! Into the box! No, no, no! Quick! Run away as fast as you can! Huh? Oh man! We're stuck in our box! Where's my… Abracadabra! A rose I have a. How do you do that? Pretty cool, don't you think? It's totally real! Look at it! There you go, little rose! I need to see it too, Brian! Just look at those petals! Oh yeah! I hear you loud and clear! The rose has spoken, and I'm officially inspired! Watch these petals go, baby! And the colors really make it pop! See the different texture here? Now it really comes alive off the page. Never underestimate line drawing. So simple, yet brilliant. Now for a little bit of shading. The shadowing really makes a difference. But it does take some time, so patience is key. It's all about retracing your lines and dots. And also filling in any space. And done! Just in time! Show me what you got! Cool, huh? Do I have to… I only got the stem. Well, that's too bad, Brian. What? Okay, fine. You can have my flower, Gina. Thank you! Gonna Frankenstein this thing! There! Marvelous! It's like you two complete each other! You're both winners in my book. Kind of. Hmm. Hey, what's that? How did that even get in here? Look! That's one beautiful deer! Just look at that thing, Jennifer! That really is something, huh? It's standing? Let's get to work, huh? Just gotta get the right line started. These angles are funky. Ugh, hopeless. I need something more substantial. Bingo! Now I can get the perfect measurements. BRB! Where are you going? Ugh, whatever. Time to get up close and personal. Uh-huh. Looking good. Interesting. Now I know what to do. Let's hit the drawing board. Always start with the black paint. Ugh! It's out already? Ugh! This is ridiculous! Gah! Jennifer! You just ruined my entire piece! That's the least of my worries now. Man! Just look at this mess! Oh, I guess I'll start over. Unless… I can use this technique to my advantage. Think this looks too dark? It won't for long. Just blot the paint right onto the picture. Now lift up this layer. Then work on the space above. Two colors are always better than one. Cool, right? Now let's bring in the big guns. Use the brush to flick the paint outward. It gives a really cool effect, see? Almost done! Run the brush over the trees, too! Even a toothbrush can do some magic! A few skillful flicks are all it takes! Cool! 
Now peel off this first layer here. And you've got yourself a nighttime forest scene. Isn't it magical? Check mine out! <gasps> How'd you do all that? Well, the winner's clear this round. Well done, Wendy.